Good morning, my darlings. Welcome to a brand new vlog. I've just curled my hair and not brushed it out yet because I'm wanting, I'm hoping the curls are gonna cool down and then last a little bit longer today. So excuse my crazy hair, that's why I'm standing a little bit further back to start today's video. But today is a day that I've had to look forward to for a very long time. We are heading to Dalesford for a Christmas, I think it's canapé specifically cooking class today which I'm so so looking forward to. Loads of my favourite girls are going to be there so it's going to be a really really fun and festive day. It's just a typical fairly grey <laughs> autumnal day today but we're going to be inside in the cosy warm and it's going to be it's going to be a lot of fun. I just checked my diary to see when this video is going live and not only is it the day before my birthday, <laughs> which is very exciting. But we are by now in the midst of Cyber Week. It is all kicking off. So just a little reminder to check out my Cyber Week Black Friday hub on my blog, which I'm updating multiple times a day. There's going to be links and lists of all the best sales, discount codes, early access codes, and an edit of the best bits over on the blog. So keep an eye on that. I'm also doing daily newsletters, so make sure you're signed up. And there are some little giveaways within the newsletters as well. So lots of reasons to check those out. Anyway, I'm gonna make myself a coffee, finally brush through my hair. How great are these pajamas, by the way? So these were actually a really, really kind gift. They are from Sleeper. I've got them in pink. Um, but these are a really lovely gift from Bare Minerals to celebrate some of their new lip products, anti-aging lip products, which I'm looking forward to giving a go. But they're just the most gorgeous deep shade of green linen pajamas with this little ruffle detail. And I absolutely adore them. So this is my outfit of the morning. Time to caffeinate and then get dressed and ready for the day. I honestly think my camera does weird things um, color wise when I wear dark colors. It's as though it's just not used to me wearing dark colors. So this is my favorite moment. I'm gonna brush out the curls. What I would recommend doing if you're trying to get your curls to last a long time is when you use hairspray, spray from underneath because then the act of the hairspray settling doesn't bring the curls down with gravity, if that makes sense. I normally put a tiny bit on um, before brushing and then always use a wet brush, a, fly, a wide bristle one, because then it doesn't fluff up the curls too much. Still a little bit curly underneath, <laughs> like Dickie. <laughs> okay, that looks good. We'll add another layer of hairspray and then before we go, I'll add some oil as well. I really don't know what to wear today. I want to be quite glam because all my pals are going, but I don't want to be too glam because we're in the Cotswolds. <laughs> oh, the struggles of wanting to be glamorous, but living in the middle of nowhere. So I think I'm going to have to wait until my coffee kicks in to decide that, but I'm going to start accessorizing myself and I have got some beautiful, beautiful pieces to choose from, from Missima. Missima have launched their Cyber Week sale. It is 25% off the entire website which is their biggest and best sale of the entire year so now is definitely the time to stock up on your favorites choose your christmas presents treat yourself there are so many amazing pieces ranging from daily kind of basics hoops little subtle pieces layering pendants to some incredible collections and i'm in love in love with these pieces there are so many to show you, so I'm gonna get started. I've got quite a few here in front of me. I'm just gonna show you my favorites and then we will start accessorizing. Okay, so this is one of my all-time favorites from the new collection from Missima. It's just got the most gorgeous details. You can see it's this beautiful pearl necklace chain and this really weighty, it kind of looks a little bit antique-y. Um, pendant with this cross and gemstone in the middle there. I love the idea of layering something like this with a more simple chain, such as one of the flat Missima snake chains. So that's a combination I'm going to try. I have got two pairs of earrings here, which you've probably spotted me wearing already because I have been wearing these so much. They're so striking. I never really loved the idea of mixing and matching um, earrings before, but these 
actually do come as a pair. Um, so you can see you've got this beautiful moon charm, star charm, and then this little kind of fan shape at the top here. They're just so intricate. They almost look like heirloom pieces. So they're a little bit more statement. For something a tiny bit more subtle, you can see that the charms do come off. So if you want to wear just like a twisted plain hoop by itself, then you absolutely can. But then if I pop the charm on, you have got another pair of earrings with a star and a moon. And I just think this trend of the Celestials is so timeless. If you're also obsessed with this greeny shade right now, like I am, I think that this style of jewellery goes so beautifully with it. So I think most of us know Missima for those more everyday pieces, bits which you can layer up and literally you don't have to take them off day to day. So these would be great bits, especially to stock up on during the Black Friday sale. If you are a fan of layering, a few of my favorites, this is a double chain. So you've got a slightly thicker, almost kind of snake style chain and then a really dainty gold chain. You could either mix this in with something from the new collection, a pendant like this absolutely stunning one. I think I might wear this one today. Or perhaps one of their more simple pendants along with a chunky chain. This I think look, looks absolutely gorgeous with some chunky knits. I think I'm going to do a little try on later and show you a few different outfit options um, but when it comes to layering necklaces especially if you've got a really gorgeous like fluffy white cashmere knit layering necklaces over that is such a perfect look for winter, the perfect way of finishing off a more simple outfit. So I'll show you some different combinations later on and throughout the vlog. But for today, I think I'm gonna keep these earrings in. Let's have a little rummage in my jewelry drawer for some rings. One of my most, I hope these are in stock. I'm gonna go for one of my chunky rings. This is one of my oldest pieces from Missima. I have been wearing Missima, oh my goodness, for probably five or six years, I still have my very first Missima piece, the classic, iconic Lucy Williams um, horn pendant necklace. They're the kind of pieces that you can wear every day or say for special occasion. And they're so timeless, you'll have pieces in your jewelry collection for many, many years to come. So such good investment pieces. And price point wise, I would call Missima demi-fine jewellery so you get beautiful quality gorgeous timeless designs and yet you're not paying astronomical prices so perfect for gifting perfect for treating yourself to what other ring shall i wear um mm -mm -mm -mm. this one here is another of my favorites i love to layer up the yellow gold and then I'm going to start my necklace layering with this flat curb chain. This one I think is really, really versatile no matter what layering you're going to do. So I'm going to start with this one, pop on my outfit of the day, and then decide which other pieces to layer this with. Okay, different option. So I have popped on this gorgeous ruffly knit and you can really see how beautiful the different layering of the necklaces looks here. I wonder if I could even go one more with the flat snake chain. It's always always a case of the more the merrier, I think, when it comes to layering necklaces. It just really adds a, maybe they are too similar in length. There we go, but Missima do usually give you enough chain to play with. That is a really, really nice trio. I think they look absolutely gorgeous to get the perfect over a cozy knit like this one. That looks so lovely. So this is option two for today. Shall I switch the earrings for the dramatic ones? I always think if you're wearing a knit, go dramatic with the earrings. It's a simple way of adding a little bit of drama to an otherwise casual knitwear piece. There we go. I always like to have the crescent moon facing inwards and then we have got the beautiful star on the other side. Oh my gosh, I love how this looks. Okay, and finally option three, which I realise from this angle looks very similar to option two, but option two is a jumper and this is a jumper dress, if in doubt. <laughs> go for a jumper dress and I have popped in on this side which is the ear that gets <laughs> seen the most because of the way that my hair falls. I have got this gorgeous um, pearl and I'm pretty sure because of the design of these earrings um, I could also attach that pearl to, for example, one of my chunky chains. Instead of clipping it in my ear, I can just clip it to the chain. So that's a really nice way of getting a different look out of these earrings. And then my lesser seen ear 
is this snake. I love the Missima mix and match earrings. You can get so many gorgeous charms, um, but I think it's quite nice to just get that like subtle, subtle <laughs> hint of a snake if my hair blows a little bit. Kept the same rings on because they're classics. I'm covering my hand because I burnt the top of my hand in a mince pie related instant on the Arga. And then because we've got a lot of detail here, but I still want to have a little cluster on my neck, I've just got the flat snake chain and the flat, um, what did I call this earlier? Just the flat chain, I guess. Chunkier chain. And I think that is perfect. I'm happy with the outfit of the day. I'm gonna add a little bit more of a vivid Lipstick. <laughs> what lipstick shall I wear? Where's that Urban Decay one? Aha. I've been very much enjoying Urban Decay lipsticks lately. It's a really nice balmy one. Gorgeous. That will come with me in my handbag. I think I will take my Chloe. Perfect. This is the perfect outfit of the day. My Reese boots, crossbody Chloe bag, big enough for my phone, my vlogging camera, and a little makeup touch up. Okay, we got there eventually. I'm going to finish with a mist for my face. What makeup should I take with me? A little bit of concealer. Where did I put that lipstick? If in doubt, shove it all in, and we're ready to go. Okay, made it back to my favourite familiar festive place. I think everyone's probably going to be waiting in the cookery school area, so I'm going to head through the courtyard and hopefully meet the girls. So of course I'm the first one here, the local gal to Dalesford, and this, I can't believe I've never been in here before, this is the Dalesford Cookery School. I'm not too sure what we're going to be making yet, but the table is set and it looks so, so beautiful. We've got a little menu book here, oh my gosh show-stopping canapes got a prime position here next to where all the action is going to be taking place we've got our elizabeth arden eight hour cream ready to go and then over here looks like we've got coffee and is this pan au raisin here little snacks pan au chocolat on the most beautiful butcher's block and we've all got these stations ready to prepare some delicious festive snacks I have been joined by my fellow countryside lady. What is your beautiful outfit of the day, darling? Talk me through. So I am wearing a Catherine Tucker coat, which uh -huh. we got last year. It really does need to be tailored. On is it side. tweed? It's a bit long. It is tweed, it's So yeah. beautiful. But it's really you nice. You could almost sort of... get like it pinched in a tiny bit, couldn't you? Yeah, probably. I so think lovely. Nice. I'm just so, I'm very petite, so it's difficult to find things that fit. But I do love this coat because you do have the... Ooh, what is it like suede? Yeah. That's a very the festive color. The quality is gorgeous. It is stunning. The silhouette is beautiful. I didn't know if it might have been like an old Holland Cooper because it's like the design yeah, that they similar, are trying to emulate. Like it because it is quite tailored in the back and she's known for tailored pieces. Catherine so, Hooker. Yes, and she's a favorite um, Kate Middleton. I knew you were going to say that. I love it. I always steal uh, Kate Middleton's ideas. So. She's got a very elegant, timeless style like you. Beautiful and Chloe boots and Louis Louis boots. bag. Yes. Beautiful. And underneath, I'm just wearing. I can't remember where this is from. It's another jumper dress I keep them for years. Beautiful. So it's a, a long tote jumper dress. Gorgeous. Yes. So glam. Very simple. Beautiful. Totally classic. Gorgeous as always. You can put whatever what you want through here. You can stir the tap through here. You can put chopped rosemary or thyme through there. You can put sun dried tomatoes. Something that's got like. Anybody got a pasta machine? Yes. Yeah, you do you use it? Um, <laughs> it's just a lot to clean, isn't it? A lot to clean? Yeah. We don't clean. Really? They well, do. Give me a bit of a brush down. I wouldn't get any water on there because it will get into all the rusty. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. That's why this is fermented. Okay, as a, um, as well. uh, so we're just going to roll this out, as you can see. Nice. Squares or circles. It just means you're going to get. Leftover bits, okay, essentially. And could you roll up the leftover bits and. Tray, okay. And you're going to push and stop, okay? You can do the little flick if you want, or you can just stop and give it a little. We've just had a little uh, masterclass from Chef James, and now Robin and I are baking partners. We're going to have to make macarons. Macarons. Yes, and Robin is cheap whisker, so we're going to have egg whites, whiskey, and this is the corner. Expertly done. So, it's all about getting as much air in the macaron as Robin is a bit of a 
a pro baker and so we have <laughs> we whisked the egg whites into soft peaks and added the icing sugar and now we are folding in our flour mixture this is ground sunflower seeds um, with a little bit of orange food coloring in there and we're folding it in to try and keep as much air in the mixture as possible And up next we are making cheddar and thyme gougeres and they look absolutely scrumptious so Robin has put me in charge of this cook because there, is, there are quite a few similarities between this and a mac and cheese roux. So we've got some milk and butter melting away in the pan. Robin's whisking away an egg. What are we going to do? Um, All I can do is whisk. You're a pro whisker. <laughs> my job. This is my Official job. whisker of the day. <laughs> in the same room that we've just been doing the cookery school so while they get that all ready we have come for a little shopping session Charlie and I were only here four days ago so I'm basically acting as a tour guide for all the other girls that are here we're currently up in the garden center um, looking at some little Christmas tree decorations and beautiful Emma and Emily's first time in the hamper room which hamper would you have if you could have any Dalesford hamper for your Christmas gift there's so many to choose from oh, I would have rosé cleaning products Vegan products. Oh, I didn't try that yet. Um, I literally spoon fed it to myself. We actually may have eaten all of our macarons, but this would be for me because you've got chocolate. That is a great one. I didn't even know I liked Clementine cups. <laughs> now you're obsessed. Is that going to be a new Delta of session? Do you know what? These are actually the best crisps in the whole world as well. Oh my gosh, so we good. love those. We actually so buy good. those in London. And also, sorry. aren't they gorgeous? Not, for, not, in, oh, not including the sale, I was going to say. Oh. Oh, not for individual sale. Because oh, it's yeah, part of the hamper. hamper. What's your hamper of choice, Emily? Oh, I like the little gardening ones. Any foodie ones. This is cute though. That's a kid's one. Aww. That's adorable. I feel like it's so sweet. For this would be going in a hamper. You've got rosé. <laughs> you've got dark chocolate golden honeycomb because you're golden Ooh. darling. Aww. And you've got a little bergamot. And a little candle. candle. So cute. And some organic biscuits. And some biscuits. Ooh, they look good. You're organic, you're golden. Mm. Sexy. <laughs> yeah, sexy. And you're oh my gosh. Like fine wine because you're <laughs> So we're heading back in. Lunch is served. Oh, look at these beautiful napkins. Oh, no. Hello again, darlings. Back home again. That was the loveliest way to spend the morning and early afternoon. Such, I feel like I learned a lot, a lot of different techniques that I will be putting into practice for Christmas. And just so lovely to catch up with so many of my favorite ladies, oh my goodness. So you might have spotted something very exciting in the background. I have received a Luisa Villaroma order <laughs> while we were out, it arrived. Um, so I thought I would go through a few of the pieces with you right now, but first I need some lip balm. 
my goodness. Um, <laughs> and <laughs> perfect. I've got the Elizabeth Arden 8 hour cream. We were learning a lot about some of the deals that Elizabeth Arden have got on for Black Friday today, of which there are some incredible deals. I'm going to pop some on my mince pie burn. <laughs> and then some on my lips as well. Yes, there are some incredible Black Friday deals for Elizabeth Arden, so I'll leave those linked down below. It's a perfect opportunity to pick up something at the most amazing price. But speaking of Black Friday, so Louis V. Roma, that sale is insane, <laughs> so good. There is 40% off full priced things, except for those items which have got a star by them, they're excluded. But honestly, all of the bits that I had on my wish list are not excluded. So I have got quite the selection that I'm gonna share with you um, now. So I couldn't resist trying this on straight away. This is an Isabel Moron jumper. I have just got it on with my brown Amazon leggings. Jumper, cardigan, it's a cardigan with this classic kind of cable knit to it. Love that you can just do it all the way up, be super snuggly. It's got a ginormous collar, as you can see. You could definitely put a polo neck on underneath this and really nice to dress it up with the jewellery. And I love when your jumper shows off a cluster of necklaces. So this is the first piece. I don't think I can wait any longer to try on this dress. When's this video going live? This is a major sneak peek because that is potentially what I might wear for my birthday party. So let's give it a try. I'll just show you this cardigan while I'm stood up as well. I kind of wish there were some little pockets in here, but yeah, this cable design, I'm just absolutely loving. Perfect, if I step over here, I can see myself in the mirror as well. Just the perfect lounging around the house during the festive season cardigan. It is so snugly warm. It's a really nice fit to it as well. It's very flattering. Oh my goodness, you guys, this dress, I think, I think this is the best thing I have ever tried on. Oh my goodness. So this is just, this is definitely, definitely what I'm going to wear to my birthday. I was a little bit worried. Obviously, I have had a few glasses of rosé already today. My makeup is not looking that fresh. I kind of wish I could do it a bit more justice for this first try on, but I think you can tell just how special this dress is. The material is like water. It just, it feels like, I can't even tell you what this is. It's like slippery through your hands. It feels ethereal. Ethereal or ethereal? I don't know. <sighs> the way that it glistens, it's like a bronze gold color. I definitely need to have a spray tan, but it comes with this waist belt, which cinches you in perfectly, perfectly around the waist. Um, just the way that it moves on the sleeves, my goodness. There is quite a high somewhere. Ooh! slid um, and probably elsewhere as well. Oh, okay, so you've got this top layer. Yeah, and then a little slit there. So definitely need to make sure I've got plenty of tan and probably some Charlotte Tilbury film star bronze and glow on that leg. But this is just the perfect, the perfect 30th birthday party dress. It feels so comfortable. I think I'm gonna wear this as my Christmas day dress as well. It's far too special to just wear to one event. Oh my goodness. It just feels so special and I feel like this is not doing it justice. So I'm gonna change in something else and you guys will have to tune in for my 30th birthday celebrations. Hopefully in a vlog soon so you can see how this looks when I'm properly styled up because there is no doubt in my mind I am definitely, definitely going to wear this to my birthday. Um, and I will leave it linked down below. I hope this is still in stock because the sale is so good. This is probably gonna get snapped up, but. Mm. I love it. Okay, back into something a little bit more normal. <laughs> that dress. I don't know if you could tell from that last clip that I was a little bit overwhelmed because you might be able to see in the background, I was also trying on my, um, needle and thread gown. I feel like because where we're going for my birthday is, it's a pub at the end of the day. Yes, we're having friends over here first and after, um, but it is a pub. And I felt that, that was just a little bit too much. Whereas 
the Costarellos, the bronze dress is so perfect and I'm just so happy to have a dress like that now in my wardrobe. It's really special. Christmas, I'll, I'll probably wear it for New Year. I'm probably just going to wear that for every special event from now on if we have a winter wedding to attend. Anyway, I'll stop going on about it because it's probably sold out, um, but I will leave a link down below as well as any discount codes that you might need. I don't think you do, um, but anything that you need to shop the Luisa Viroma sale, I'll pop down below. So anyway, this next one is another chunky knit because I'm obsessed with chunky knits. Looks so nice. In fact, let's switch out the earrings because with a chunky knit, obviously you can't see your necklaces. So I feel like the earrings really do have to do the talking. And as much as I adore these, and I really do, I think they are my favorite. I miss my earrings right now. I sometimes feel like a chunky hoop just goes even better with a really super duper high roll neck. So, a couple of my favourite hoops from Missima, and all of these, literally everything is 25% off, which is so incredible. Um, these you'll have seen many a time before with the little pearls, the dom hoops, I love them. They are amazing, but then newer in my collection are my little bobbly hoops. They almost remind me of like pirate treasure because they are this vibrant shade of gold. So classic. So timeless. Yes, they look amazing. So this is just your classic, super chunky cable knit with a big weave, the big open sleeves, not too long either. So if you do have some nice rings on or nice bracelets or nice watch, um, then you can still see them. Isabel Moron Etoile. Isabel Moron is another brand that I always actively search out on Louisa Viroma. They've got so many amazing brands. If you've not heard of Louisa Viroma before, it's a website that has some incredible luxury brands and I believe everything comes from Italy. So yeah, this is definitely a keeper. I really like how you've got this slight contrast in the knit here and this huge, super cozy neckline. Okay, and I'm gonna just sit down. Ooh. Hello, darling. Okay, that was Charlie. I am, I'm on a 10 minute countdown because our videographer has just arrived and we are filming something very, very exciting this evening. Again, the red dress might be a little bit of a hint. Let me know what you think we're filming down below because I'm very excited, very, very excited. But first I need to change my battery. Okay, new battery is in. So as well as the gorgeous clothing bits, I ordered a few smaller pieces from Luisa Viroma, another brand that you can get 40% off. On selected most pieces, in fact, is Lueve. And seeing as I just adore my brown belt so much, I thought I would do something a little bit crazy for me and also get it in black. Dun, dun, dun. As much as I adore my brown, I did think it could look beautiful with certain outfits in black. I believe the brown one that I already have and wear all the time is literally exactly the same as this, but in brown is also in the sale, so I'll leave both the black and the brown linked down below. So that's Lueve. Um, what did I... I appear to have forgotten to order <laughs> the leggings, but I thought this sports bra from Aloe Yoga was rather lovely. Just a really nice neutral kind of beigey shade. It's a little bit warmer in real life in color than it looks on here, but I always find Aloe Yoga sports bras to be super duper flattering. So I thought I'd pick that one up in the sale. Another little something from Isabel Marron. So this is gonna look totally weird with this outfit, but I keep seeing outfits with these belts that are just kind of, there's obviously a very cool way of doing this, which I should really research. Um, but it's like a tie. I need to have a look at the picture on the website. I'll put a picture on the screen here. This is a little bit annoying. Um, I mean, that obviously looks awful. <laughs> that didn't quite work, but I will pop a picture on the screen of how it looks on the website and hopefully I'll be able to get that kind of cool girl, nonchalant kind of belting effect. And then I'm obviously not going to keep all of these, but I did order a few Burberry scarves because Black Friday Cyber Week is for the time. Oh, I lie. I ordered a scarf and a cape. So I need to give this a little bit of a steam, but you've got crazy Burberry on the outside, classic brown on the inside, 
or the other way around rather. I am a huge lover of capes. Probably not ideal over the top of an already super chunky roll neck, but you can see how you just get a little glimpse of the Burberry stripe if you want to. You could cinch this in with a belt. Um, yeah, I love that. That is so, so nice. And I don't think I'd have been quite as keen on getting this full price, but in the sale, just amazing. And then the second option is a newer print for them. And it is this one here. So it's got the deeper Burberry, the new logo on it. I do also have a classic Burberry scarf, but I thought I would update my collection. I love that it's more classic on the other side. So once again, depending on how you wear it, you can wear it with the classic deeper kind of chocolate Burberry side, or you can flip it and have the new branding or a little bit of each. These scarves also make such a good Christmas gift. I mean, how luxurious to open up your gifts on Christmas morning and someone's got you a Burberry scarf or a lovely thing to put on your own Christmas wish list because as far as designer bits go, they're not ridiculously expensive um, and it's just a really nice way of adding that luxury touch to your outfit. Again, it just looks so nice, this whole cozy neck cluster with a high neck, the chunky gold earrings. It's making me so excited for like frosty mornings and proper winter snow days. Um, hmm, is this Max Mara? No, Loro Piana, Loro Piana, such a luxurious Italian brand. And I just thought, how gorgeous are these gloves? All of my gloves are white at the moment, the ones that I own, which is not the most practical. I love how high up these are, especially with a jumper like this. They are gorgeous. Again, full price, very expensive. Um, but in the sale, I'm getting spendy, love. And then I, something made me search Barber on the Luisa Villaroma website, and this is a lot brighter than I was expecting. But yes, they do have Barber jackets on Luisa Villaroma. Um, and I thought this one was rather different. It doesn't feel quite as waxy. I mean, it is a wax jacket, but it doesn't feel as waxy as my other wax jackets. This is their, Ale oh, it's one of their Alexa Chung ones. Okay. It's quite a vivid green shade, but actually over this neckline, um, I really, really like it actually. It's got this zigzag stitch detail, nice big deep pockets. It's very neon, I must say. It's quite a bright green, but very different definitely to any of the bits that I have in my collection. So let's roll up the sleeves a little bit. I always think that looks a little bit better, a bit more relaxed. <sighs> I'm not sure about this. Not 100% sure, but you guys, let me know down below. I now need to go and film our... Um, exciting thing that we are going to film. So darlings, thank you for watching today's video. I'm going to wrap it up here. Don't forget, I'm going to leave the Missima Black Friday sale down below. You can search Josie LDN on their website and you'll find all of my favourites. It's 25% off everything, which they never do, except for now, which is such an incredible opportunity to get all of your favourites and more at the most amazing price, including their new collaboration with Harris Reed. All their pieces are so, so wonderful. All the sales that I've mentioned today, I will leave linked down below. So darling, that's all from me for today. Thank you for watching. I will see you tomorrow for another Cyber Week video. And don't forget to check my blog post. Check my blog post first thing tomorrow morning because there's gonna be even more sales going live tomorrow. Um, so you'll be the first to find out about them via my blog post, which I'll be updating at about 5 a.m. <laughs> all right darlings, I'll see you tomorrow.